and crying with people. People were so happy for us and just like then the moment we walked out and got in the car I started getting texts from other people in church who saw us leave and they were like we're praying for you. So excited to meet Elijah. Like I just love that it happened during church and they were all able to be a part of that moment. Oh this is it's going down. Yeah. He's coming down and out. Last time this room is going to be empty. We're coming for you. <laughs> we Ali, we'll see you in a little while and we're going to go, we're going to go meet Elijah and we'll bring him to you in a few weeks. And you just hang out on your mat, hang out with the friends and that sort of thing. Yeah, okay. your friends are gonna come here, and your little hairy boy, he's gonna be here for you too. And we love you so much. We'll miss you. We love you so much. I love you, Bonesy. Mm -hmm. We'll miss you. Mm -hmm. You have a Merry Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> I love you. I love you too much. I can bring you, brother. <laughs> Where's the baby? Harry! Where's the baby? We're gonna bring a baby home. I love you. I love you, Harry. I'll see you in a few weeks. <laughs> oh, you're embarrassing me. Not on camera. Oh. Here, say goodbye to your dad. Okay, bye bye. Hey, look. He does not want to be held. We love you. <laughs> he needs all Toodles. Okay, bye, Harry. Love you so much. Love you, buddy. Bye. All right. Checklist. Okay. Triple, quadruple checklist. We have the medicines. Okay. Breast milk. We have breast milk. Palmazine. Palmazine. <laughs> Car seat. Bassinet. All the baby stuff. I think we're good. Computer, charger. The little dongle thing. I got the dongle thing. <laughs> you right? <laughs> we could be like driving away from the hospital in like a day. <laughs> with a baby in the back seat. Oh, man. This is unreal. All right. <clears throat> Are we good. ready? We're ready. All right, let's do this. On the road again. I just can't believe we're on the road to you. I just can't wait till you're in our back seat. Yep, 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 yep. It was such a sweet moment when we, that we were at church this morning and um, 
<laughs> got a text and decided to get on the road and just hugging people, saying goodbye, and just friends just being sweet. And Excited for us, praying for us, praying for everybody involved. Yeah. Oh man. doesn't start till tomorrow at 3 p.m. So my dad booked us a hotel with points, which is such a huge blessing. And we're gonna go in, put fresh ice in the breast milk coolers and wait, wait for a call. If things are picking up, then we will drive, I think it's 10 or 15 minutes to the hospital. You know, some people would say like, road trips are easier without kids and I don't care. I am thankful. That's our last road trip without him. Yes. I haven't even met him and I miss him. So <laughs> we're gonna go try to get some sleep and then we'll see what tomorrow holds. Getting random items that we're gonna bring in the hotel room for the night. We might only be here another hour. We might be heading to the hospital after that. Don't know, that's okay. It is 12.45 on, what day is it? December 20th. December 20th. I wonder if this is gonna be his birthday. December 20th. Um, we just are settled into the hotel. Um, we are Oh man, do you think we'll sleep at all? I don't know, it's so hard to know whether we should try to sleep or if we're gonna get ready to go to the hospital in an hour. Um, yeah, we're just messaging back and forth and feeling out what, what the night's gonna look like. And uh, yeah, it's so wild. And our hearts are just so ready and excited. <sighs> okay, I'm just realizing I spent weeks 
packing all of our baby's stuff and he's probably coming in like the next 12 hours and I just realized I didn't pack a hospital bag. Like a bag. Uh, well, and to be fair, our thought process was that we would yeah. come down here, unpack our bags, yes. and settle into our Airbnb, and then we would be going to the hospital. So it's fair that we haven't yes. done that. Right. But we just realized we probably should do that. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, I thought we were going to get to the Airbnb and unpack everything and look at all the baby clothes and decide exactly what I want to bring. But I might just have to get into the suitcases out of the back of the car and pull a few things out. <laughs> oh my gosh, I literally just looked at Peter and was like, I didn't pack him a hospital bag. <laughs> because we had planned to come down tomorrow morning and we ended up coming about 20 hours earlier than we had planned um, because things are happening so it's been such a beautiful adrenaline rush and here we go the adrenaline rush continues and I need to pull the suitcases out and pack him a hospital bag You know what's the perfect movie quote right now? What? <laughs> Did you sleep good, Elf? Buddy the Elf? <laughs> yes. yes! I got a full 15 minutes! Oh. Is that the line? Full 20 minutes. 20 minutes. You were so close. Okay, I remembered that I did pack a hospital bag at one point for in case we had to fly. Mm, that's I did, true. but that that's has true. since been unpacked and repacked a different way. So, anyway, just thought I'd put that on the record. <laughs> All right, headed to the hospital. It's 154. We're gonna go in, we're gonna get checked, and we're gonna see if we are in active labor. We'll see if we stay or go home and labor some more at home. Or run into you. Okay, we just spent three hours at the hospital. Dry run. Practice run. Practice run, yes. And we're going to get some rest now. Yes. Hopefully, everybody can. Yes. I think today could be the day baby arrives. Can't wait to meet you, baby. 